Fans of Blackpink, I'm sure you know the girls all live together. It seems pretty common for these K-pop mega bands to share a home just like BTS does. The four Blackpink ladies share a dorm, which is actually a multi-million dollar condo in the most expensive and elegant building in Korea. In this video, we'll take a look at where the girls call home as well as the Blackpink house and more. Blackpink is probably the most well-known K-pop girl group worldwide because like BTS, their audience grew globally over the last few years. They're from South Korea and the band consists of members Jenny, Jisoo, Rose, and Lisa. I think I got that right. Apparently, Blackpink means that the greatness of a woman is not only visible from her beauty, indicated by the color pink, but also from her talent, indicated by a strong color like black. The group is formed under YG Entertainment and debuted on August 8, 2016 with their single album Square One, which had their first number one song in South Korea, Whistle. From there, Blackpink found commercial success pretty early on in their career and even signed with US label Interscope in 2018. As of last year, the group is the highest charting female K-pop act on the Billboard list and among their other accomplishments, Blackpink is the most subscribed music group on YouTube as well. It's, I think it's but. Like, you know how people say after you go on um, a stage where you feel like you really interacted with the crowd, um, it, it lasts for a long time and it's really addictive. I totally experienced that this time. The girls are all in their early to mid 20s, so I'm sure they don't mind being roommates together. With their fame, I'm sure it makes for quite the experience and gives them a way to bond even more. As far as I know, the only one who is said to have her own apartment on the side is Lisa. The other three have family homes to stay at from time to time with their parents. Other K-pop bands have stories of living in crappy apartments before they made it, but not Blackpink. The girls have amassed quite the fortune over a few short years, and it's helped them live in luxury. The estimated net worth of the group altogether is around 32 million, and each girl has about 8 mil to her name. Hey guys, it's Karen. Today we're doing another house tour here on Famous Entertainment. We're gonna take a look at where the Blackpink girls call home, including their fancy dorm, the Blackpink house, and more. If you like these videos, make sure you're subscribed and ring that bell to be notified we post so you can always be up to date. We've also done house tours on the likes of K-pop boy band BTS and many other celebs, and we'll link to some at the end. Follow me on Instagram because I love connecting with you guys. I've also been reading all your comments and I'm going to be responding to some at the end. I need you to let me know who to do next in the comments down below and whose home you'd like to see. Now let's get into this video. We'll start with the Blackpink house. This place was more for entertainment purposes than as a real home for the girls, but it's definitely become well known. In 2017, Jenny, Jisoo, Rose, and Lisa moved into a temporary residence where they had to spend 100 days. It was for their TV show where they got to share their entire experience with fans. Blackpink House was a South Korean variety show that aired on local TV as well as YouTube and documented the members in their everyday lives. The girls had to do all regular things like cleaning, cooking, and laundry. The house could be described as a pink princess house where each room portrayed each group member's unique taste. It was located in Hongdae, Seoul, which is an area near Hongik University, or Hongik University, which it's named after. It's known for its urban arts and indie music culture, clubs, and entertainment. Sources say that the house was previously the Hello Kitty Cafe in Hongdae, but that could just be the outside shots, and so it could be used as a tourist site. But then again, they said the cafe was fully renovated to turn it into a house for the Blackpink girls. The Blackpink house was definitely eye candy and already on the outside, it fits the theme with a big pink door surrounded by vines and greenery. There's also a pink roof atop the home. The entire property has gorgeous gardens around it, a long stairway leading up to the front of the house as well as a large patio to relax on. When you first walk in, there's a photo of Blackpink when they first debut as well as a pink cubby area with a built-in couch. Also on the main floor, there's another pink seating area that runs along one wall and under a large window, making for a perfect photo zone with lots of light. The girls had a roomy kitchen with brand new appliances and one of those fancy fridges with a TV screen on it. There's also an additional wine fridge and a long formal dining table. The living room sits by sliding glass doors that open up to an outdoor patio. There was a big sectional couch with room for Jenny, Jisoo, Lisa, and Rose all to sit on, even their pets, considering the small steps for them to get up there. Blackpink's main bathroom had a large tub and a full vanity mirror with seating area where I'm sure the girls got ready and did their makeup. On the second floor, there was another living room with a smaller couch, but a cozy area to sit on the floor too. One wall at the back of this room 
bedroom was made up of shelves and from there you can reach the girls' bedrooms. Through the left door was the room Jenny and Lisa shared while the other one was Jisoo and Rose's. There was also a neon sign outside that read all day in the pink. During their time living in the black pink house, they made some fixes and additions of their own like a mega sized chessboard in the garden and more fun decorations. The home also served as a pop-up concept area for fans at one point where you could experience sets from the music videos. So apparently a lot of the fans came around like 12 o'clock oh. and like that's why we have 7 o'clock. We're still fans though. We're not as yeah. on their level, but we're still fans. Anyways, I'm sure you Blackpink fans have seen more than enough of this house. Why don't we look at where the girls are actually living these days? Yeah. I love that part. Yeah. <laughs> as I said before, with most K-pop groups at the beginning of their career, they often have to live in cramped apartments together that are far from luxurious. For example, even BTS had to live in more than one small place, even once sharing bunk beds because it was so tiny. However, this didn't apply for Blackpink. The girls moved right into a top-of-the-line home. Jenny, Jisoo, Rose, and Lisa got an apartment in one of the city's most prestigious buildings. Blackpink lives in the Han River Bamsim Apartments in Seoul and it's very impressive. Seoul's the capital of South Korea, duh. So the girls have close access to everything. The city is full of modern skyscrapers, palaces, street markets and more. And of course they also live near all the other K-pop celebs. At their apartment complex, like the name suggests, they get a view of the beautiful Han River. Not to mention, Jenny once posted a photo showing one view from the dorm, and here you can see the whole city. The listings for a four-bedroom suite at the Han River Bamsim start at 10k per month for rent. If the girls purchased the condo instead, it would have cost in the multi-million dollar range for sure. Inside, Blackpink's dorm is quite spacious, and by the looks of the floor plan, there are at least four bedrooms, meaning each girl has their own room. It also looks like there's a bathroom for each of them too. The girls tend to keep a lot about their home private, which is understandable, but they have given some glimpses inside, and we can at least see how each of them decorated their bedrooms. Although this building isn't as famous as the Seoul Forest Trimage, where some of the BTS boys bought properties, it's considered just as lavish. For a group that can still be considered K-pop rookies, I'd say Blackpink isn't doing so bad at all. I, mean, I have to say, when I was performing at Coachella, it was the most intense one hour of my life. Like, that was... Just too much energy from everybody, like, I couldn't handle it. I'm still not over it. So now we've taken a look at where the girls from Blackpink live and looks like Jenny, Jisoo, Rose, and Lisa all live together in usual K-pop fashion. At one point, they were living in the girly Blackpink house made especially for their reality show, and now their home is a luxury dorm in Seoul overlooking the Han River. Although you might think each of the girls have their own places on the side, as far as I know, they don't yet. The only exception is Lisa, considering she's from Thailand and doesn't have a family home here. It's been proven she has her own apartment she stays at from time to time since her family lives back in Bangkok. Because she's the dancing machine of her group. <laughs> because she's Lisa. Because oh. she's Lisa. Oh. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Yay. Rose, Jisoo, and Jenny go stay at their parents' house whenever they're not at the black pink dorm. It's also rumored that some of the girls' pets live at their family houses as well. Okay guys, now I'll read out some comments from previous vids. On our recent Britney Spears Who Dated Who video, Tom commented saying, Nice content, you deserve more subscribers. Thanks so much, Tom, that's nice to hear. And on the same video, Sarah Ledger wrote, You exude so much class, girl, love your channel. I love Britney, but gosh, she's been a busy girl, lol. Such a sweet comment, thank you. And I know, I didn't know Brit dated so many guys, but I love her too. Finally, on our BTS house tour, Felicia wrote, I really like that she said she's learning and may get things wrong and pronounce things wrong. Which was definitely about my hosting, so thanks, girl. I already knew I was gonna mess up, but that's fine. Hopefully I did a little better this time. All right, guys, that's all I could find on where the girls from Blackpink are currently calling home. What did you guys think about their shared luxury dorm in Seoul? Was there anything about their places that I missed? Let me know in the comments as well as what other celebrity houses you'd like to see. Follow me on Instagram if you want to chat, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye.